me giving you more, showing you more of a side of me, or me, like me lying to you because I've made a mind up about you, yeah. Wait, what to it lying to me? Yeah, like me showing you everything with my life. I don't want to lead you on. Certainly, at some point or the other, each and every one of us needs some sort of assurance or the other. Hello guys, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. My name is Vicky and if you're seeing me for the very first time, hi! Please consider to hit on that red subscribe button, subscribing to my channel and turning on your notification bell so that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new video. And please give this video a thumbs up, leave me a comment in the comment section. I really do enjoy reading from you guys. And please guys, go subscribe to my personal channel where I post videos on family, lifestyle and vlogs and every other interesting videos in between. The name of this channel is Vicky M and the link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section. Please go and support your girl. Please, 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 please. Now beg Ali beg na. Oh, guys, yesterday Erica and Kidwire were having a lengthy conversation. I just wish I could just put the whole of the clip in this video for you guys to hear and just see it for yourself. But unfortunately, I cannot, and I'll be giving you guys more of the gist and putting a few clips for you guys to also hear the important part. So Erica and Kid were talking about their relationship, and you know, obviously, Erica is always the one demanding for more assurance from kid like trying to make sure that she, kid is feeling the way she is feeling or trying to make sure that they are in sync or something like that but for me i actually do not feel it that way so erica actually told kid that ever since they've been talking that kid has not said anything concerning what their relationship will be like outside the house and trust me kid has obviously been avoiding that whenever erica talks about it he doesn't talk talk about his life outside the house mentioning erica in fact he has spoken about seeing nengi seeing v brighto and the rest of the housemates but he has never spoken about seeing erica on the outside part of the house i'm complaining about this i'm not saying you have to see me i'm just trying to explain to you that this is the reason why i say okay I can't expect to see another side of you because you don't even talk about seeing me. So how am I supposed to even see the second side of you when we're outside the house? You said I can only see that side when we're outside the house. But when we're outside the house, we never talk about anything like being with me or seeing me. So and Rebecca was like, you've talked about seeing bright too, but you've never talked about seeing me. And then kid was like this yeah that's what it is because he'll be seen bright in abuja and it is safer there you want something more no i get it i know i know i know i'm not giving you more i've said it i know i'm not i have my reasons for giving you more um there are a lot of things that Erica wants to hear from Kid, you get. But Kid keep, keep telling Erica that he cannot give her what she is actually looking for. Because first off, she, he does not have it in him to give it to her. Erica also mentioned or spoke to Kid about being cold to her and not having some sort of emotion. And the housemates have been saying that Kid is cold or something like that. And is it is that how he really is, or is there more to it or something like that? And and Kid made Erica believe that he has not found someone that has reached into that part of him. You get. And K, Erica was like, "Is it that you have not seen anybody that have really touched your emotional part or what?" And then Kid mentioned the three people that has actually reach that part of him which is his ex dj copy and his manager and i'm like okay that means there's a girlfriend that has actually gotten to that part of kid wire but erica has actually not gotten to that part and this is me doing what i feel is right for me and i feel right i feel it's right for you as well my thing is right for me because me giving you more Showing you more of a side of me, or me, like me lying to you because I've made a mind up about you, yeah. Wait, what to it lying to me? Yeah, like me showing you everything with my life. I don't want to lead you on. You know, the whole thing was going back and forth, and then Kid went ahead to tell Erica, like, that, like it's something not that he cannot take her to their house, but his family, some sort of find it. I don't know if he's trying to say they, they might not accept her or not. I don't want to misquote him, but let me just put it for you guys to hear it for yourself. You 100% need to have family love. Your family needs to love you, and I'm not saying they won't, 
I just know my life my life is very difficult to bring girls in unless I completely break away from my family and decide to do something on my own which is what I'm trying to do that's why I said I'm not ready because I need to be more independent I don't know what you guys understand by what kid is trying to say because trust me the whole of the conversation yesterday was really making kid feel really really exhausted and the way he was he just feel as if he's exhausted from this setting for this particular kind of conversation or the other but you keep seeing erica pressing and wanting more even though erica was still encouraging him that okay he should try to find himself or he should try to know what he wants you know be alone and know what he wants and Guys, the whole story is really, really long, but trust me, Erica is looking for an for an assurance, which kid is being very careful not to promise her because he keeps saying that he doesn't want to promise her what he cannot deliver or something like that. Yeah, that's what you have to think. Just be on your own for a while. Think what you have. ask yourself questions. Don't let anyone influence. Just think. What do you want? Forget I don't, I don't want person. to be around. Yeah, just forget every other person and find out what you want for yourself. I said I want to be around. Then you do what what is necessary to get what you want. Simple. And I'm like, oh Jesus Christ, this guy is a I don't know if I should say he's a playboy, but that is just his person. But that's by the way from Erica and Kid where I don't want to be stretching the topic too long so that i might not be saying what is what is not you get and then moving on let's be, let's talk about the housemate that has left the house our work never finished on top of their matter yes watoni and brighto went on an interview and then the interviewer and in in beats fm 99.9 .9 fm you get said was asking watoni what she's up to uh what she's up to about apart from her baby talk and the rest and watoni said that she will be going into rap music and i'm like what so we did not hear you rap even once in the house what's going on here but hear it for yourself um aside your baby talk show and your fashion line or, uh, in, and all of that uh, is there any other ventures that you'll be going into now that you're out of the house yeah okay music you just, rapping you you rap mm -hmm. okay there's a beat going on right now let's put you on the spot right now yeah, when, so uh, uh, why I'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> what Watoni said, and then talking about Tolani Badge. Tolani Badge, um, they were, they were, the interviewer also asked Tolani Badge about the fact that she said she was interested or she liked um, new. And then Tolani Badge cleared the hair, even though while she was talking, you see that she was already getting pissed at the end of the day. She was like, people should try to understand that liking somebody is being attracted to someone is different from liking and i'm like what's the difference as in if you know like person how are you attracted to the person i don't know if it's just me but that answer seem doesn't doesn't sit well with me you get but she just felt she just said that we should take her words and stop you know turning things around for her you get you know was there was there did neo stand a chance maybe so um let me just you know let you know right there um i don't I, I know for a fact that I never said that I liked Neo. I think Nigerians need to understand the meaning of finding someone attractive and liking them. I said that I like I find Neo attractive. That that does not equate to I like Neo. You could be attracted to somebody does not necessarily mean you like them. Yeah. And I made it clear that um him and V were in, in a you know situation. If he was free, maybe I would have pursued that. All I said was I find him attractive. attractive. And I would really appreciate it if my words are not like twisted around. I said I find him attractive. I did not say that I like him because I can respect boundaries. And also, Brito confirmed that he is just friends with Watoni Lord Bellish said they are just friends you get so that's just it and then the housemates that are out they have started grabbing opportunities by creating different match for themselves like Watoni has the boot up gang match you know because she's always she's a boot up queen wanting to be booed up wanting to be with someone wanting to you know that kind of a thing so she had the boot up um a match and then Brito talked about coming up with the apply pressure match like this housemate well anything to actually gather the bar anything to actually gather the money is welcome you get so that's just what the housemates have been all about they have cleared the air about what they've been into what only said she and brighto they are also friends and that's just basically it i just felt like let me just come give you guys an update and not leave you guys in so thank you so very much for 
watching this video please if you do leave me a comment in the comment section please i really want to hear what your thoughts are about this erica and kid wire because the back and forth is becoming too much about their relationship you get leave it in the comment section i'd love to hear from you give this video a thumbs up and please go check me out on my personal channel the link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section subscribe please when you get there thank you so very much for watching my video and i'll most definitely see you guys in my next video bye guys